Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Cozy Crochet Monster, and I am back with a, another video on my How to Crochet series. Today, I will be teaching you guys how to half double crochet. So this is the next step after learning your single crochet. So in my first video, I taught you guys the slip knot, the chain, and the single crochet. This one is the half double crochet, which is the next step. So you guys will need hook, some yarn, scissors, and needle. We will first take our yarn, make a slip knot. If you guys need a more detailed video than the previous one, highly recommend. If you're just starting, go back because <laughs> this might confuse you a little bit. Okay, so we're going to chain. Any amount, doesn't matter. We are just practicing. That seems like enough. So, okay, so I just finished my chain and we're going to start with our half double crochet. So this one, you're going to yarn over before you insert your hook. So this is a little weird, but so you're gonna yarn over and then insert your hook. So not into the first loop, but the second loop, okay? So insert that. You're going to yarn over, pull through the first loop, so just the chain. Now you're going to have three loops on your hook, okay? So, um, there's the half double crochet and then the double crochet. Um, for this one, I'll just show you the half, but they're both kind of the same. So then you're going to yarn over once more and pull through all three loops. So this might be a little difficult for your first time. Um, try not to splice your yarns where you like cut the fibers in half. It makes it all nasty. Don't do that. Make sure you get through each and every um, loop on your hook and just pull through. I'm gonna show you again. So yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over, pull through first loop. So you'll have three. Then going to yarn over and pull through all three. So this stitch looks a little bit different than the single crochet. Show you one more time. Yarn over, insert your hook, yarn over, pull through, yarn over, and pull through all three. Just like that, and bam, you got two stitches down. Only 100 to go, <laughs> kidding. Those are the basic stitches, and then you can make cool designs. Oops, well, yarn barf, okay. But you just keep going all the way down. Oops. Okay, just made it to the end of my row. One more stitch, and that is it. That's how it's looking. So now we're going to continue onto the second row. So we will do this by um, chaining one again. So something to just take note. So depending on the stitch, you will um, chain a different amount of turning chains for the height of the stitch. So you're just trying to get back up so you don't kind of cut it off and it kind of leans um, and grows back to its normal size. So. You want to chain one, and then you're going to half double crochet into your two loops right there. So you yarn over, insert your hook, you yarn over, pull through, you yarn over, and pull through all three. And just keep going. And that is how you half double crochet. And there's my second row. So this stitch is taller um, than the single crochet. I think the half double crochet is my favorite stitch out of all of them. I use it quite frequently because I like the height, but it's not as tall as the double crochet stitch. Um, but it doesn't take um, as much yarn as the single crochet. 
Okay, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Bye guys.